Hey, I'm Ryan, and this is Fanpull.com. I'm here to show you what it is and how to use it. So, this is Fanpull. This is what you get when it's shipped to you. You've got yourself a pole to hook your flag onto, uh, an upper and a lower part. The poles just join together by putting together like this. And then you use this tool that's been given to you in your kit. It's the nifty keychain tool right here. And then you can just tighten your pole together to make it one continuous piece. So that's your fan pole. Now you gotta decide, how do I wanna hook this to my car? We have two different options. It comes with the collar base. This collar base will go around a standard sized receiver hitch. So if you wanna tow something to the game, if you've got a trailer going on, or if you've got your uh, receiver hitch in there, you just put it over it, and then you just put it right into your uh, receiver hitch there. Today, we're gonna to show you the standard fan pull hitch. So you got your fan pull hitch here to put it in your car. I'm gonna set this thing to the side. You're gonna use the, you're gonna use the two parts that are given to you here, these two, to keep it in. So I'm just gonna insert this and we've given it three notches. A lot of times your car might have a tire on the back of it or the trailer hitch might be up and under your truck or something. So you can use the furthest hitch away. On this one, it's kind of out, so we're gonna use the very, the very last hitch. I just put the pin through it and then attach the pin to lock it into place. Now, I'm ready for the flag pole that I put together. I got the flag pole here, the fan pole, hook it into place, and then you take your last pins here that you've been given, hook this through, and then hook your pin through. It's as easy as that. Now, I want to attach the flag. So, I'm going to be putting on a standard size flag. I've got these two clips that hook onto it. The same tool that we used for the, uh, the pole to put the pole together is the same tool that we'll use for this. It's just your keychain tool here. So, I get my flag, and most of these three by five flags will have grommets on it. So you just hook this to a grommet here, put that through, then whenever I need to, I just hook that in. Using my tool, I can tighten it up. Same goes for down here at the bottom. So you'll notice with these bolts that we have on here that they have a unique kind of shape and a pin inside of them. They're a locking pin. With this tool that we give you is a unique tool so that somebody couldn't just come by and wrench off your, your flag, hopefully. But this is a unique tool with a unique head that uh, will undo your flag here or tighten it up. And then also the same tool is used to uh, hook your, your upper and lower fan pole piece together. So this tightens your fan pole up so that nobody can steal your fan pole. So if I want to adjust the size of the flag on my fan pole, all I do is take the tool that's provided to me, the fan pole keychain piece, put it in here, loosen up the bolt, then I can just uh, take this piece here and slide it up and down the fan pole wherever I want it. Now you want these snug, you want these to be tight on here. You don't want it to be loose at all. So you try to tighten these up as much as you can here. Now that's pretty tight right there. Give it a little tug. It's tight, it's not moving on the bar. So now I've got my flag set up. I've got it locked in down at the bottom. I've got it locked 
I've got the pole locked into it. The pole's locked to itself. I got my fan pole set up. Got my fan pole finial on top and used all the tools. It's as easy as that. Less than a minute, you can be showing your support for your favorite team.